The population is ageing. Those aged over 65 will double and those aged over 85 will quadruple in the next 20 years. Chronic disease at present consumes over 70% of the total healthcare budget and is growing so rapidly that it could consume all of the state budgets within 20 years. Telehealth is one of the best ways of trying to reduce hospitalisation and therefore hospital costs. The telehealth system is basically a monitoring system with quite a large screen to help guide the patient through the different procedures. Typically the process takes 20 minutes. Patients take their blood pressure, they record their blood oxygen, their blood glucose, their electrocardiogram, their body temperature, their body weight, and they answer a number of clinical questionnaires. This data is then gathered and sent off almost immediately to a remote website to become visible to the care team. The data is collected in real time and can be viewed almost immediately, particularly for patients connected to a broadband system. I monitor my uh, clients once a day and looking at viewing all the data entries that have been transmitted to me. It is quite straightforward and it is a very easy process. I can see the information in real time. I can monitor them following up with a phone call if there's any issues with their health. Your blood sugar level uh, is looking a lot higher this morning. Also, with the time that has been freed up for me, I can look at then um, more new, new clients being uh, referred to me. The trial targets chronically ill patients that have complex chronic conditions that tend to take them to hospital multiple times a year. They begin to self-manage and this is really important because this has been demonstrated to be very effective in helping to keep patients out of hospital. So the patients are a key player in the total management of their chronic condition. I jumped on it straight away when uh, Lay came to me and said would we want to do it and there was no hesitation. Before she was going to the doctors two or three times a week. Now uh, she only goes once every three weeks and uh, with the help of the, this monitor uh, I don't get so scared anymore. Before uh, I was wondering if it's safe to leave the house you know, uh, because many times I've come home and she's been laying on the floor or she's injured herself and it takes a lot of pressure off your GP. This way uh, you don't need to go down there if it's, if it's only something minor. If telehealth is to be scaled up nationally, we need to have a way of being able to identify changes in patient health status on a daily basis. CSRO is developing some very interesting new tools to, to facilitate this and to allow nurses to understand the patient's condition on a day-by-day -day basis. I can't uh, thank her enough for, for what uh, she's done for Janice and uh, what the machine has done.